All right, guys, as you can see, we are at a, another new construction because of our fancy Corey over here. He's still struggling. Okay, sounds great. <laughs> Give me a few options, okay? All right, we just walked in here. What's up, Corey? What's up, man? You know what I love about new construction? Everything is brand new, man. I mean, oh, we're yeah. in, in. I know quality construction when I see it. Look at this woodwork, really nice paint and sand job. It's been caulked well. You can see they didn't get any paint on the hinges. So they've done a really nice job there. Hey, look at those handsome guys in the mirror. What was that? What up, what up? It's what? all in the finishes, right? That's like right. It's all in this minor, small little details that you see in the houses. Vinyl plank flooring, super easy to take care of and keep up and up. They pre-wired for televisions and for cable outlets. Just they thought of all the little details. You want to know what the best part of this is? They didn't put it all the way down here. They already put it up so you don't need to have those wires dangling the whole time. They're ruining the view of everything. Because you know everybody wants to hang their TV on the wall nowadays. <laughs> it's 2022, y'all. Let's Seriously, do this. Let's get with the top. Let's see the rest of the place, man. Let's do it. All right, one quick thing to note down here, there are a bunch of windows going down the hallway. This is so, so nice, because it really lightens up this space here, because hallways can get a little bit dark sometimes. And they're casement windows. Do you know what a casement window is? I actually don't. Because I do. Call me, I'll tell you. All right, <laughs> check out this nice little uh, coat, uh, closet. coat closet here. Everybody loves a good coat closet. And then, ta-da! This, this is why we're here. Look at this thing. Dude. I mean, you got a little dining room table. You know what, over there, you can even actually make that into a little office space. You I absolutely could. Got that could. little nook kind of situation set up. You know it. <laughs> hey man, this is a super flexible space because it's really wide and open. Right. Because you could use the dining space uh, here, which is what everybody's using. Now with the countertops, man, it's like you, everybody wants to hang out in the kitchen. Have you ever had a party? Everybody always ends up in the kitchen. Every time. So dude, what do you think of these cabinets? I love them. I love them because they're, the shade on them. They're almost mm. like a little sand wood it matches really nicely with the flooring here. It's almost giving you a little bit of a, not beach vibe, but maybe beach vibes in Colorado. Yeah, I'll give it a little weathered wood look. Yeah. Nice, light and bright, keeps it open in here. Yeah. As you know, everything is brand spanking new. So check it out over here, you know, pop in a couch, kick back, relax, wide open views of the city. Come check this house out, cause it's the bomb.com baby. Bomb.com. Hey, did you see the balcony out here? Well, yeah, I saw the balcony. Don't mind if I do, brother. Look at this. I mean, we're talking maintenance-free decking. I just give her a little snudge. Look at this. Wide open, man. Oh my God. Look at this. You gotta have maintenance-free decking in Colorado. It's a must because it just gets pounded and hammered with the sun. So looks like they might put a couple other sites out here, but these duplexes are really nice. Now, at least for now, you got some incredible views out here. Look at the amount of sky you see. Downtown should be right over there. So you unfortunately can't see downtown, but you can see the whole entire plains. Let's Ooh. go back inside. Switching it up? Oh, Switching man. up the cameraman? Mix it up, dude. All right, well, follow me then. Let's go check out. All right, where should we start? Should we go upstairs? Man, let's go up. Look at those railings, dude. They're solid. Custom. They feel really, really good. Yeah. Got some nice black steel in the middle here. Custom, beautiful railing. And listen to this. That's hardwood. Hello. That's hardwood. Come on, so one thing to note, the floors continues all the way up the stairs here. Everything is nice, bright, light. You got an amazing, really cool chandelier right there. A nice little window to bring in some even more additional light here. And the best part of this upstairs area, which I personally really, really like, is 
that they kept the hallway pretty small. They kept a small hallway here and put all of the livable square footage in this amazing bathroom. Here, let me turn on the lights. There we go, that's probably Don't a little mind bit if better. We do. Check it what out. What you doing in that mirror, man? Trying to stay out of the shot, but you I guess know. I'll step in. <laughs> yeah. So, check it out. Got a nice color to the tiles here. Matches with the white. You know, we can't have everything white. We got to have some pop of color. Some really cool cabinets. I'll call it an aqua marine. And then we've got, pop around there and kick them lights on for us, would you? Let's see what we got. I mean, it's like a second vanity area off of that bedroom which is really convenient yeah multi-functional same cabinetry as downstairs check out this you got a lot of cabinet closets here too oh, so man. for all your towels all, all your linens really everything that you need up here in the bedroom so you can keep them all right here i have such i have so many linens you wouldn't even believe <laughs> it man too many too many check out here you got a beautiful closet and get a shot of this carpet here. This carpet's amazing carpet, really nice, a little bit of a gray tone to it that matches nice with the white walls and those uh, sandy, uh, what did you call it, weathered wood? Yeah, weathered wood, and then this is a very fine modern Berber, if you will. Um, but I like it too, man. A little tight weave, it's looking good. Look at this flood of light! Wow. Well, we know we got a nice new roof because we can see it. Oh yeah. Mountain views from this bedroom. Can you imagine this bedroom in the evening? Man. Think of the sunset, the Colorado sunsets mm -hmm. behind the mountains right there. I like your style. Put a little desk set up. Yeah, I take it back. No desk downstairs. Put the desk right here. You got the beautiful view. Catch the sun rays at the end there. Ah, oh, just enjoy it. 1006 Xenon Street. But wait, what? We got a laundry room set up right here, right here, right by the bedrooms. Who thought of that? My goodness. Right. And then one more sweet master bedroom. Ta da! Woo! Yeah, let me get a couple lights on here. A couple lights. And this place is so window. sweet. Hey, Evan, come check out this closet, man. I mean, it's a closet with a window. <laughs> oh, that's some good lighting. Put a little mirror right here. You got everything you need. Nice view too out of this closet. Hey, Corey, you don't get a view in the closet every single day. Nope, you sure don't. Come check out this bathroom. Look at this. Even the big fella can get in here. This is nice, man. Nice slider door here. Keep your towels hanging. This place has it all. Man, we really lined it up with new construction today and you don't even have to deal with all the weight because this place, you can grab it today and secure this home for your future. Great deal, 1006 Xenon Street in Lakewood, Evan. Let's sign off. See you guys. So long. Evan, we can't leave our people hanging without showing them the basement of this sweet place. Big shout out to Kelly Stasny and the crew over at Red Tea Homes for giving us the opportunity to be here. This basement is unfinished. Evan, do you know what a structural floor is on a basement as opposed to a slab floor? No, tell me. Well, let me just tell you, it's all about soil testing. And here in Colorado, sometimes you got to do a structural four instead of the slab because of the expansive bentonite soil. Does your agent know about expansive soils? Because if not, you better give us a call so we can give you a private tour of this place. Man, this would make an awesome little studio office space. It is a killer walkout basement. All right, my friend, until the next one, let's go. See ya.